least five individuals approached this person and started shooting. So we can only assume at this point he was a tended target. Um, we're not sure if there's anybody else out there, but uh, obviously for safety reasons, we're asking anybody who does have information to contact us. And there's a lot of evidence markers out there. <laughs> um, right now we have at least, well, well over 40 rounds were shot during the shooting. Was he the only one in line at the food truck at the time you uh, There were multiple people outside and around the food truck. However, at this point, there has been no other um, reports of anybody else being shot. No one else injured? No, there were vehicles that were shot that were in the parking lot, but however, there has been no other actual individual that has been shot. Any idea how the five got away? Was it a car? Uh, right now, we do know they approached on foot and they ran from the area on foot. Um, we have had canine out here trying to track uh, for the uh, you know, for the scent of them running off into the air, we do believe that they possibly had a car parked down around the corner uh, where they left the area. Okay, around which corner? Uh, I'd be the corner to the north from the um, actual from Diamond Street at the end of Diamond Street. Okay. North. Um, do we have a description of that car? Is that what people should be looking for? No, we do not have a description. We can only assume because they did disappear from the area and the tracking of the canine was lost. Any further description of this car? Uh, the only thing that we've gotten so far is potentially five black males. Uh, we do not have any other really physical descriptions at this point. Before. And what about surveillance in this area? Uh, that's what the detectives and patrol are out doing now. They're canvassing the area, one for additional witnesses, two for video, and uh, hopefully we can catch some on some of the back streets that uh, border this area so we can catch the vehicle coming in and out. Any weapons recovered? Uh, nothing at this time. No weapons at all? No, no weapons were recovered. And so they're canvassing right now what happens after the hours where we go from there. Well, the main thing is identifying who our victim was. So that way we can start backtracking from there. We can contact his family. And that way we can sort of start filling out what he was into, friends. Uh, those are going to be the people who hopefully would have the most information. And this happened in the middle of the day. I mean, what, what, what does that do to your investigation? Open your eyes? Well, I mean, sadly, it is a very violent crime. Just the safety of all the people out here. We're glad that right now there are no other victims. But we do ask, you know, obviously it's important for people who have any information to contact the sheriff's office. Do you know how many times they've been shot? Uh, we do not know exactly. Uh, we know that we're both people. And it was a large gathering? Uh, it wasn't a large, there were several people outside. It's a food truck, I and mean, it's a known area where people come to get food and stuff. There's a couple of little, uh, food trucks in the area. So, and I know it borders uh, the church here on uh, Edgewood Avenue. But nothing affiliated with the church? Nothing affiliated with the church. I know in cases like this a lot of times people don't want to say anything. Are they people that have been that were around? Are they cooperating with you? So far people are mm -hmm. cooperating. Um, obviously they're in probably some fear and shock too. So uh, right now sometimes it takes a little while for them to recall exactly what happened. So we will be touching base with them again. Uh, we obviously make our initial contact with the victim and the witnesses, and we go forth by uh, contacting them afterwards to find out if there's any more details that they can remember. When he was at the food truck, do you know if the food truck operator may have known him from previous times buying food there or anything like that? At this point, we've uh, spoke to the food truck operator, but we have not been able to get any information if he actually knew who the victim was. Any other questions? I know I came late, they just want to check. Was there any conversation that started it? Uh, at this point, uh, a group of individuals approached this the victim and just started shooting. There was no conversation, no argument. So that's why we're believing it's possibly that he was the intended target for this group. But at this time, until we get him identified, we don't know exactly what. Has there been another shooting in this area recently that this might be like retaliation? Uh, not that I can put off. I mean, there are definitely, unfortunately, in this Jackson where there has been multiple shootings. Um, I don't know if there's anything, again, until we can identify who our victim is um, and his um, you know, his friends and find out exactly what took place. It's hard to actually keep back to anything else. And just for confirmation, you said he was pronounced on the way to the hospital or at the hospital? At the hospital. At the hospital. Thank you. Thank you so much.